Hey everybody, welcome to the Carriage Play of Suikoden. Welcome to THE Carriage Play of Suikoden. Yeah, it's uh, a... It, it feels like a return. It's like a cozy return to Suikoden. You know, Suikoden 2 built this channel on rock and roll. <laughs> And uh, going back to the on, roots on Rock X Castle, on Rock X Castle. Okay. Yeah. Uh, hey, 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 thumbs, thumbs up. up. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Tur gets us. Oh, okay. oh, sorry. Carrie gets us. Wait, yeah. are, are we gonna see a cutscene? Oh no, yeah. still loading screen. Unfortunately, I don't. I don't know when or if we'll get back to Chrono Cross. We'd done a big bulk session and it got wiped. Yeah. So uh, we were going back to something like comfortable that we know that we like. So this is an interesting start. Let's just take the next 45 minutes to just discuss this room. Yeah. Okay. So we. In honor of our original. Okay, <laughs> name, name another game that is ballsy enough to start in a waiting room. True. Truly. Well, and then also, like an RPG like this, that doesn't start with text box coming up, you have, you can walk around this room. Yeah, this, there's no text crawl. I don't even need to talk to this guy. I don't know who this guy is. I'm just going to walk around him. Oh, shit. I've never actually done that. Master Carey, son of General Tio, could you please wait a little longer in the waiting room? I didn't even know you could walk past him. Weird. Can we leave? Oh, no. No, that's not the, the exit. Mr. Curry, there is still some time before your audience with the Emperor. Please wait with your father, General Tio. <laughs> Charlie. Charlie, it's the legal powers on, Charlie. <laughs> it's Kazim. So you're Tio's son, Curry. Show me your face. Nice face. Closer. Nice face. <laughs> you have an excellent... Oh, my, oh God. my God. This is a... Just like your father. Ooh, <laughs> an important man like him too. I, Kazim Hazil, uh, guarantee it. Because uh, I studied phrenology, which isn't just like another name for racism. <laughs> I feel like I need to go take a shower after that conversation. <laughs> what with the the uh, phrenology or no? The, uh, just like the just the uncomfortable just like, nature of it. Yeah, so yeah, like we're just rolling. Middle aged man, just we're Audi. <laughs> we're Audi right now. <laughs> Where did you sneak in from? This is the room of Commander Craze of the Imperial Guard. Ooh, he seems nice. I'm sure it's warm in here with all these candles. And tiger skin? Tiger skin? Oh yeah, probably. Sir, so, you're General Tio, sir. How you've grown. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just look at these shiny boots. I've dreamed of joining the Imperial Guard since I was a little kid. It's me, Sex <laughs> I've always wanted to be a member of the Imperial Guard. <laughs> so anytime we say anything about Ireland, we make <laughs> any sort of Irish. Ir <laughs> yeah, it's it's gotta be Jack Hey kid, where did you come from? The Emperor is upstairs and Commander Gray's room next door. Yo look at my paper. <laughs> uh, check out my paper. <laughs> okay, not a good way to start or like if you've never played this game. I didn't know you could walk past Tio in the waiting room. Yeah. Uh, don't wander around too much, uh, Master Carry, or your father will worry. I wish we would have been our name would have been Bates. <laughs> oh. <laughs> don't wander around too much, Master Bates. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, uh, should I be insulted right now or flattered? <laughs> yeah. All right, Dad, Can, talk to us. Yeah, we're out of we're out of middle school jokes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, have you talked to Joe recently? Okay. <laughs> Joe, Mama. Okay. <laughs> Am I Tio? Uh, yeah, I guess you could be too. What's the matter, Carrie? Are you nervous? Don't worry. The audience will be finished quickly. Just be the way you always are. The Emperor. Stupid. <laughs> with a nice face. <laughs> Kazem always tells me. He's, he's sad, but has a nice face. <laughs> the Emperor is stern, but there's nothing to be afraid of. Mr. Tio, Mr. Gary, the Emperor will receive you now. Please come this way. Well, 
I guess we should just go, right? <laughs> Dear McDowell, General of the Imperial Army and his son Carrie McDowell, here for an audience with the Emperor. Wow, that woman really has an annoying voice. <laughs> you, She's fine for like about five minutes and then you're just done. Wow, is he missing part of his nose? <laughs> okay, listen. Let's not descend there quite yet. <laughs> Welcome to our things. Much as they were when we fought together in the War of Su Succession, Your Highness. Oh, Tio, I always love that you remind me of this War of Succession. <laughs> it's like, remember that tragic thing that happened? Remember when we burned that village of oh. children? <laughs> Good times, old fellow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Impressive words. Yeah, Do you yeah. not agree, Wendy? Wow, he's got quite a cleft in his chin. Next time you look at his face. Indeed, they are the words of a great general. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we know she's an ass kisser. Dio, I am sure you are about the troubling activity in the north. King of the North! <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. Game of Thrones. Have you seen season eight yet? It's my favorite season. <laughs> best season so far. Would you be willing to travel there to protect the border? Build the wall. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> How disputes with the United City States of Jouston are complicated, but with General McDowell in charge, we can rest assured. Jouston sounds like some sort of hellscape. Oh my god. As long as there's not a game that takes place there. My beloved sword, Prack, has brought me luck on countless occasions. Sounds like Prick. <laughs> my beloved sword, Prick. <laughs> It's the biggest <laughs> sword you've ever seen. I would like you to have it. Take it with you. <laughs> yes, open my cloak and take prack. <laughs> <laughs> Bend the knee, Tio, for <laughs> you want to take prack. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is already gone off kilter. Like it's like oh, this is you know it's, it's, it's this this game is so heartwarming, and warm and cozy. Yeah, cozy. <laughs> This is for the winter vibes. Grab a blanket. Let's talk about the Emperor's penis. <laughs> Thank you, Your Highness. I, Tio, swear not to disappoint you. You have my blessing. Good luck, Tio. So, your Tio's boy. Gary. Nice face. I really like your face. <laughs> Just like your father's. <laughs> Quite an impressive little countenance. <laughs> Do you think he's the old like uh like uh the old guy with a walker from Family Guy? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Get back here. Get your fat ass back here. <laughs> Listen, Carrie, would you be willing to give the Emperor a helping hand <laughs> while your father is protecting the northern border from the Canadians? <laughs> okay, what are we doing? What are we doing? Uh <laughs> like father, like son. Listen, Carrie. Someday, you will follow the path of your own choosing, but for now, you have a great deal to learn from me. Plenty of time for freedom later. Thank you for your kind words, Your Highness. Commander Craze of the Imperial Guard will be Master Carrier's... Carriers? Master Carrier's superior. Ooh. What an attractive young man you are. Good luck to you, Carrie. We had better get going, Your Highness. We, uh... You, <laughs> we have, in, <laughs> we have a, like, a dinner arrangement <laughs> with somebody more important than you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm relying on you, Tio, and Gary. I hope your efforts will surpass the powers. It's a pretty low bar, if you know what I mean. <laughs> get, let's get out of here. Let's go. Let us go. Ah, first time in his... Uh, Dad, can you not fall <laughs> so close? <laughs> it's like he's spooning <sighs> you as you're walking. <sighs> hey, hey, Carrie, I have something to tell you. <sighs> <laughs> uh, thanks, Dad. Yeah. Like, 
I could deal with that. Seriously, dad, dad, seriously. Your, your hot up. breath on my ear. Back up. My ear. Okay. Love you, love you, kisses. Do you want to talk to Kazim? I think uh, Tio has something to say to Kazim. Who was Kazim? You. Ah, uh, damn it. What did I do? Ah, uh, Tio, it looks like you've brought a fine son into this world. I envy you. You're embarrassing me, Kazim. Embarrassing. Uh, Kasim, so far, uh, kind of unlikable. <laughs> <laughs> Just seems like kind of a big creep. <laughs> this is Crazy's room. You'll be reporting him starting tomorrow. Go and introduce yourself. Uh, okay. Hi, Crazy. <laughs> okay. Hey, so you're Tio's boy. What's your name, Carrie? Outlander. I couldn't care less if you're the son of a great general. You'll get oh you you'll get no special treatment here. Understand? Hey, nice pe uh, paying attention, localizers. To I couldn't, couldn't not. You know what I mean? Like a lot of people just be like, I could care less. Hey, that means you care a little bit. Yes, at least. Now go on home. Work begins tomorrow. Report uh, report here first thing in the morning. Did you introduce yourself? Yes. I must admit, I'm quite surprised that you've been assigned to such a weakling. But, well, let's get going. You're, I like to say he, that Tio said that loud enough for Craze to hear. <laughs> yeah. Gremio must be worried sick. Oh, Gremio, I'm going to hate this Gremio guy. We know somebody who hates Gremio. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're wrong. <laughs> You're wrong. Yay. That opinion you have, wrong. Oh, dude, you kind of got Gremio hair. You could have been Gremio for Halloween. I was. <laughs> you didn't see when I threw on that uh, green cloak and grabbed my hatchet? And then... <laughs> uh, I was about to go spoilers mode, but no spoilers. You know, the first time Jess and I played this through, we thought Gremio was, was a woman. Probably because he looks like Mom. Oh, uh, yeah, a little bit. Are you Grimmio? Welcome home, young master. How, how, how did it go? Oh, oh my god. Oh, I'm really I'm, I'm a hyperventilating. Oh my god, inhaler. Inhaler. Was everything okay? <laughs> <laughs> Were you nervous in front of the emperor? I was so worried, but I guess everything went fine. You shouldn't worry so much, Grimmio. Oh, Master Tio, I didn't notice you at all. Didn't notice me. You're fired. <laughs> Good grief. The only one you seem to care about is Carrie. Sorry, Master Tio. He's just got such a pretty face. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the episode of SpongeBob where uh, Squidward gets the plastic surgery. What? <laughs> it's like, oh, handsome man. Handsome. Oh, so I, need to, I need to watch that it's episode funny. again. It's funny. It's good. By the way, BTW, young master, Ted is here to congratulate you. Oh my god, the stew, the stew! He actually has a room and lives here. <laughs> Grammyo, did you forget? Well, Ted spends most of his nights with uh, whoever he meets at the bar, so... He's a partier. I mean, he's he's pretty old. Like, he can take care of himself. Oh, wait, oh, spoiler. Oh, spoiler, spoiler. Hey, 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 um, yeah, why, why fuck with Grimmio? Yeah, leave him alone, bud. Dinner will be ready soon. Please, rest in your room until I call. Okay, I think Pawn needs your Patrick Warburton voice. Okay, let's... Pawn's diary. Date, 4XX. Pa uh, breakfast, toast and eggs, lunch, sandwich, dinner, croquettes. Date, 5XX, breakfast, toast and fried eggs, rice balls, roast beef, 6XX, toast and... <laughs> It's a it's it's a small a bit of character building, but I think it is important about Pond's character. <laughs> um, you know what? We can f with Pond. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's deserved it. Yikes! What the? Oh, it's you, young master. Home already. I was waiting for supper and fell asleep. 
By the way, how is your audience with the Emperor? <laughs> Emperor's new groove. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Young master, how many times do I have to tell you please knock before entering the room of a lady? Oh, well, you can, uh, you can forgive it if it's my room. You can be forgiven. You can be forgiven if it's my room, I suppose. So how was your audience with the Emperor? Were you nervous? Uh, no. Cleo's diary. Young master, you shouldn't be looking at a woman's belongings. <laughs> but it's me, so it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tuesday, croquettes. And <laughs> <laughs> it's the only interesting thing in their entire lives. <laughs> it what is what, what's for breakfast? I heard the news, Gary. You met the emperor, didn't you? Tell me all about it, please. This was the voice I was going to suggest. Okay. <laughs> hey, Gary. Yeah, I know. Let's go up to your room, okay? And by Tell up to your room, I mean over there to the left of your room. <laughs> hey, does it smell like up dog in here? <laughs> Tell me all about it, Emperor. Tell me all about the Emperor. Right now. Oh, we should have named Carrie Emperor. <laughs> <laughs> Joins the entourage. This could have been Emperor's New Groove. Could have been. Should have been. Would have been. Should we start should we start it over? Yep. Alright. Please, let me join your entourage. Uh you already did, bud. I like that when we went in here, we saw Gremio go up to prepare the meal. Yeah, nice touch. Yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry, I was thinking about bad touch, uh, Kasim Hazil's bad touch earlier. <laughs> I owe so much to Master Tio, who adopted me when I was an orphan, and I want to return the favor, okay? Uh, gee, I don't know. Please, I want to work for the Imperial Guard too. Oh, please. Uh, gee, I don't know. <laughs> oh, come on. I thought we were friends. Uh, gee, I don't know. Hey, stop giving me a hard time. You're really going to let me join you, right? I know it's on your mind. Uh, gee, I don't know. <laughs> please, I want to work for the Imperial God too. Oh, please. Did that recycle there? Uh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, 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 we're okay. recycling. Okay. Uh, of course. Great. I knew you were a good friend. Now, for more important matters, what kind of man was the Emperor? <laughs> and tell me about Windy, the court magician. Was she beautiful? Come on, tell me everything. Uh, she was a 10 out of 10, a total dime. <laughs> Dime? Yeah, the ten. Oh, oh, okay. Is that a is that modern slang? I think so. Oh. I see. I wasn't familiar with your modern slang. <laughs> Thank you for explaining. I am sure I would like to see Windy in person, Yowza. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sir, I was just Easy Beavis. I was <laughs> I was thinking of like uh never mind. Maybe it'll come up later. Hey, Carrie! <laughs> I really don't know how to tell you this, but, uh... Yeah. Say, Carrie, there's something I want to tell you. Can you keep a secret? Can you promise not to tell anyone what I'm about to tell you? Young Master, Ted, supper is ready. Hey, it's time to eat. Let's go, Carrie. We can talk some other time. Must not have been important. Yeah, probably not. Probably never gonna come up again. It's never gonna come up again. Never gonna tell a lie. Are the glasses filled? Attention, everybody. I like Tio's a glass half full kind of guy. He didn't ask, are the glasses empty? You know what I mean? Sure. That's what I, that's what I appreciate about him. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, I must travel north. Carrie will be responsible for uh, the household in my absence. I'd like you all to give him full risk support. Risk support. Risk support. <laughs> Gremio? Y yes, sir. You've taken care of Carrie since he was a baby. Thanks to your efforts, 
He's grown into a fine youth with a great face. <laughs> I'm grateful to you. But, 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 sir, I this is my job, and and, and besides, serving young master is is a p p pleasure for me too. I'm glad to hear it. I hope you continue to watch over him. Cleo, Pawn, I'm counting on you two as well to help and protect. Oh, yes, Master Tio. Of course, sir. Leave it to us. And Ted, I hope you're always to be a good friend to Carrie. I do so even if you said otherwise, sir. Right, Carrie? Enough talk. <laughs> Especially you, Ted. Uh, yeah, shut, shut up. Shut up, Ted. Let's eat before the food gets cold. Let's raise our glasses. No, we were. We, our food's getting cold. Why to are we my son, our glasses? To the Empire. Empire? I hope one doesn't bring the other one down. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like I won't be seeing your face. Your nice face. Oh, so pretty face. For a while, Carrie. <laughs> <laughs> Shall I wake him up? No, let him sleep. It's good for his face. <laughs> it's not as if we'll never meet again. Needs his beauty sleep for that. Ugh. Grameo, take good care of him, won't you? I will, Mr. Tio. And we'll take good care of him next time on Carriage Play City Coden. Thank you very much for watching this episode. Gremio, leave us. Gremio. God damn it, Gremio. Stop looking in our diary, Gremio. Leave us alone. All right, we will see you everybody next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye, everybody. Bye.